kind of sort of they're doing what they were doing before ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the bug think tank where we talk about all sorts of fun nerd stuff and today we're going to talk about dc's you're the villain which was their free comic book day issue that they originally charged 25 cents for but then realized you know it should just be free anyway so this has three stories our first story is about the legion of doom and this is pretty much lex luther making his move he has he has, you know, infiltrated the White House. I'm not sure if he killed the president, but he definitely roughed him up a bit. And he has Brainiac attack Amanda Waller for the secret knowledge inside her head. I personally am hoping Brainiac knows that Amanda Waller is the one that blew him up in the first place in Justice League No Justice. Meanwhile, there are other problems going on because Lex has effectively apprehended the president, slash assaulted the president, slash attacked the White House with a bunch of well-known supervillains and Sinestro. Um, you know... Lex Corps is now in trouble, but luckily or fortunately, Lex has already been, you know, breaking up Lex Corps piecemeal, you know, selling it off, and he reels he's been he's been doing all of this to effectively start offer stimulus packages to the villains of the DC universe. And like, you know what, they've all got plans, they all got needs, but they're all lacking the funds. And luckily I am one of the richest people on earth. I am. I just am. And I'm also and I've also realized I need to believe in something. And I believe in Doom. No, not Dr. Doom. I hate that guy. Just Doom. And to take my rightful place, I have to embrace it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to fund every supervillain that wants my money. Because they should all want my money. If there's a project they need, I'll give them what they need to green light it. Alright? Everyone's Kickstarter has merit right now. And that includes people like Bane, who's doing stuff in Tom King's run, presumably the Batman who laughs, Lobo, Bizarro, you know, it's, you know, everybody, everybody, everybody who's everybody. And how dedicated is Lex this? Well, he's even going to fake his death. Next, we have the Leviathan story. Now, if you recall, for Action Comics, we kind of stopped going over that. But apparently there's a big event coming up, and the book's also gotten good, so I'm going to retread that. And this is sort of a... A look into the, to the Leviathan story, which is a team up between Batgirl and Green Arrow. Not the actual event, just this particular story to, to launch it off. And they come across Merlin, who is fleeing from Leviathan, who has been toppling down all these other secret organizations in the DC universe. I'm like, okay, that sounds cool. And they kidnap Batgirl. She's like, you know what, Barbara? Yeah, they know her name is Barbara Gordon. So, you know, Leviathan ain't playing. And they say, like, you know what, we'd like you to be on our team because you know you haven't just been bad girl you were also oracle and more people liked you when you were oracle and you've also been on the suicide squad the justice league birds of prey you know you, you've been all over and you do this because you want the world to be better than it is so we want you on our team not batman not superman not people that can't do what you do we want you and there we don't see her again and then we cut to the bat cave where it implies that Leviathan has been making this offer to other superheroes. As Damien points out, you know, I've got this, I've got this theory in my head, and I need you to, to prove me wrong, to show me that I'm wrong, that Jason Todd Red Hood is not behind this, that he hasn't been taken by Leviathan. I don't know why that's happening. I don't know why, I don't know what evidence Damien has to prove this, but whatever. Okay, and there's also apparently a hologram of who I have to assume is his mother. Because I don't think Lois Lane would, wear, would show that much cleavage. Next, we have a little event with the Justice League. So the Justice League feels a bit, you know, feels a bit, you know, stretched too thin lately, you know, because they have to stop what happened when the Source Wall broke, and then they also have to stop the bad guys on Earth. So you're like, okay, so what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Batman's like, so what we do is we have to stretch, we have to, you know, extend our rank, light the beacon, so to speak, you know, do another recruit drive, and this time won't lead to Trinity War, which you know was a thing, or you know what we did before during the Justice League Drowned, but, you know, more proactively. And so, but Batman sums it up like this. When the question is like, you know, who are we going to call? It's like, simple. We call everyone. And then we go to war. And it just looks so cool. Like, oh my god, I would love a playmat of this. And while this is going on, Perpetua is also going into motion. You know, it's like, yes, everything's going as I planned it. You know, I'm finally a awake and it turns out she may be doing something to lex or there may be something special about lex which may or may not have something to do with the fact that lex's childhood friend was actually john jones the martian manhunter so that's the dc year of the villain sneak event the free comic book honestly i liked it i liked it it's got me interested in leviathan i um, love the artwork for leviathan um actually the artwork on all three of these books has been really was really good i i love it 
And I'm actually looking forward to seeing what this all ties up to. I'm actually going to pick up the Leviathan book. I've been avoiding reading the Justice League book, so that's nothing hard. And, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited. Especially because Batman says, we call on everybody. So with that in mind, let's bring this video to close here. If you're new to the Bucket Thing Tech, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Check some other videos on this channel. I will catch you all later. This is the Bucket Thing Tech signing off. Thanks for watching. May your fandom serve you well.